Hello everybody and welcome to Dyson Fear Program. Let's play episode 10. This is actually take two. I'm sinister. I had my very first major technical difficulty. And when I say technical difficulty, I forgot to plug in my microphone. So I recorded all the footage and forgot to um, capture my voice. So instead we're just gonna use the magic of autosave and go back in time and refilm this entire section again. Um, so uh, earlier on, we had started producing some microcrystalline components with the silicone that we had unlocked. And now we determined that silicone is a really bad ratio when you take it from the rock. Um, I gotta go back and look at it, but it's like, here, let me just do a quick calculation. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Um, does it show it in this one? High purity. That's showing it right from the belt. I want to do it from... Meh. I'll worry about it. Recipe. Do we have any other recipe? Anywho. It's like 720 ends up being like 360 or something, but then 360 of the silicone ore only equals to 36 of the uh, pure silicone, high purity silicone, and then you cut that in half when you're making microcrystalline components. So I'm like getting like 18 a minute or something for that, and then in the long haul, the main use for microcrystalline components is you combine them with uh, circuit boards, and you're going to be able to make processors which I unlocked in our tech tree earlier we kind of talked about that I went along and did that it only required blue science blue matrix um, so they're gonna use it as a two to two ratio I've got lock, lots of circuit boards but I'm limited on um, the I'm limited on the uh, microcrystalline so anywho I'm gonna just let this machine build while we focus on our other task for today. So we'll get some of these going. We're going to just get a belt over there and we're just gonna let it go to town and, and just build as much as it wants to build. Um, otherwise, I've stacked my inventory. I got enough, I don't wanna say enough fuel. I'm maybe gonna grab a little bit more. I'm gonna go, we're gonna do our first uh, space flight. So we've unlocked all of our level two um, upgrades um, that's what we talked about last episode so basically I just want to make sure I got enough fuel I've got parts I've got like some of the stuff I don't think I really need but whatever we're gonna bring it all anywho like that one actually and delete that we delete that one and then again if you if you didn't know how to do that you just hit the delete button actually Okay, so the big thing we need to do is increase our productivity of silicone um, and we need to start producing titanium because of all the rocks I've destroyed, I think we established, I actually, yeah, I, I could almost get rid of that titanium. Might as well. I'll be getting lots in a second here. So this is where our, our new upgrade comes in handy, drive two. We now have the option to go into orbit so I've stocked myself up on graphite. I got lots of fuel. Um, so let's press our V button and go look at our galaxy. I'm gonna rename these next episode just because uh, I'm getting tired of Viota Libre. I like the name, but I just don't wanna call everything three, four. So when we hover over our planet, it gives us our stats. These big suckers, these, get, these ice giants or whatever you wanna call them, that's not what we're looking for fire, ice, and hydrogen. I mean, later on we might want that. But what we're looking for is our titanium and silicone here. Fortunately, the close planet doesn't seem to have any silicone. It only has titanium. Oops, I didn't mean to back out of there. But when we zoom out even farther, we have another planet, Eota Libre 1. And it's actually pretty close right now. I should potentially go over there. Orbital resonance. Anywho, we're not going to go to that one first. We're going to go to Eote Libre 4 first. So I want to set the indicator 
to point my direction. So now you actually have an indicator pointing where the planet is. So I think we're about ready to go. I think, um, you know what, since, where am I? I'm gonna grab more solar sails while they're, or I mean uh, solar panels while they're building. And I forgot that I even picked these up. No, I do want to take these. I should take more, but anywho, you know what? We'll set this to build that many. We'll take them. Take them all. So when we look at, we go back to our view real quick. The other thing it shows on the south or on the lower section, here it is, wind energy ratio. We're actually going to be getting increased wind energy. So, so you basically you hit space bar or double hit and keep holding it, and the next thing you know, you're in space. So we're going to hold shift to increase our speed. We don't need to go full speed. No, I don't want to go down there. Oh no, I don't want to go to you. I want to go, yeah. Oh yeah, spacebar. There we go. I think it automatically pulled me into that planet. It's, it's The controls are a little bit weird. Shift to speed up and then back is slow down. And then you can kind of use the cursor to aim but then you still want to use up to go up. Yeah, it's, you, then you can use arrow keys, I guess. Anywho, here we are. Boom, we landed on our, our new planet. That one was nice and close. Let our energy get up. But what we want to do is we want to take a good look at our planet and kind of see where resources lie. So we got titanium there, we got titanium there up north. That's basically what we're here for, but we have other stuff close by. Actually, you know what? We're gonna set up somewhat close to this coal vein here and this titanium vein. That way we can get some extra power if we need it. So where were we? Perfect, we're not far. So yeah, there's the coal, there's the titanium. So what we're gonna do is when you look at the map, for the little planet thumbnail down here. It kind of shows you your position slash orientation. So right now I'm facing north, south, north, but it also shows you where you are on the planet. So this is the equator. So for the power, what I'm gonna do for now is I'm gonna run a nice uh, strip along here. And then we're gonna put couple of wind turbines. Later on I'll make more wind turbines. We'll see how much we actually use this planet. But I'm just going to place a bunch of these here. I guess I could go like that too. And then how many can I get in between? Two. See, there we go. Why don't we just do it like this? Oh, it won't let me? I'm sure these are small minor bugs that they'll fix. But anyways, let's just get some quick power going here. Oh, and I forgot. Oh, I am still upgrading stuff. But you can actually, I was noticing too, you can get a couple more upgrades of level three, which is uh, red and blue science. Um, no, not that, not core, not inventory but speed and an extra drone so basically more drones mean faster building right so whatever we'll just keep those going Oops. it's not going to be perfect but it should get us enough power to do what we want to do while we're here which is actually not much basically we're going to set down some some miners and we're gonna get uh, some titanium going and right now we don't have any way to really transport it except for ourselves right so okay I used all my solar panels um, I got six more of these let's throw them out like that there we go help my drones a little bit okay so take a look at our power after and so again I've done that right along the equator uh, it gives me the most eventually like if I were to wrap a ring around the entire planet I would end up getting technically not unlimited power but I'd get a steady set of power based on the solar panels so anyways 
We're getting 22 megawatts, which is more than enough according to my calculations to the left of me on my other screen. I'm only actually going to need uh, 5 megawatts for this factory. Oh, there's still stuff to build over here. So I'm going to do my best to keep it a little, a little more neat and tidy in this one. Okay, I'm gonna do, it'll probably just pick one power line, I'm sure. Okay. You guys finished building. Done. And my power will start going to the back up. Okay, so I'm just gonna double check my ratios here, but I'm pretty sure if I, I'm just gonna produce it like one full belt. So you actually need to pull out two belts off of the titanium ore. So we're gonna get, let's use shift and our arrow keys. That's, one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's a half a belt. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. There's another half a belt. Okay, we can stack some more buildings now. And we need. There we go. So that is our, um, that's going to be our 720 titanium ore, and then we're going to, let's build that one there. So what we'll do is we'll run here, and then we're going to need melters because that's usually what you do with ore so we're going to smelt that and it's going to go on to this belt and then we can actually like mimic that right because we're going to take two full belts of ore and put them into one full belt of, um, of titanium so Something like that. This one there, and then you really not gonna go there. Cheeky bugger. And you know what? You're cut. You're cut. I wanna shift you around just a little bit. There's six. Oh, that's worse actually. I don't like that. Now yeah, whatever. Sure, a little swoop de loop. Okay, there we go, there we go. That's that's how we want it. So then, what I've learned is to stagger titanium ingot, titanium ingot. Okay, so on the back side, it don't matter. You go normal. Normal. Put that on this side. We'll put this one out on the back side. We'll put this one out in the middle. That way, when we copy and paste, we don't have no headache. No muscle, no flesh, no coconuts. Whatever they say, I'm not gonna go. Okay, so five on that side. Five on that side. And that's that's it. That's 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 our build. That's our little one belt of one belt of, uh, of iron or uh, titanium. So we'll just stack that up and just let this sucker fill up. We're gonna pull it in there, put a couple just to give her, and then we're gonna make sure everything's got power. That guy's missing out. Go there. Go here. Go that way over there. I guess we need one more. Right there. Get rid of that one. We all good. 
All right, there we go. I do, oh wait a minute. No, see, I'm jumping the gun. I'm trying to speed through things here. Okay, there we go. Once that's done, now we're talking. So that's 180, 360, and then 360 times two is 720. And that's gonna make us a full belt of titanium. So that was our big goal for today. We've successfully started producing titanium on one of our sister planets not too far away from our home planet how far is this guy a minute that's still pretty close so but basically all we can really do for now is manually transport things so you know i'm gonna actually leave a storage here and i'm gonna leave a little bit of everything leave some of those and some of those and some of those that may be a couple of those and, and that and that and then that way when I come back I don't always have to make sure I've got supplies I got a few packs so I'll just dump it all I'll dump that I'll dump that a couple of power some storage some splitters gears and stages and steel and we don't need to leave that there probably don't really need that stuff there Yeah, I think that's good. I think I got, I think I got a good, well, I'll leave, I'll leave you guys there. And then what we'll be able to do is, I'll probably just hang out here and make sure I have enough to take a full inventory back. But so that's it everybody. We could uh, now just fly the 30 seconds it takes or whatever to get to our, our second planet. And then when we're done, we just, oops, no, I wanna, Always hide label. Auto show. Sorry, we want the indicator. You know, now I just make sure I got fuel. I'm fully charged. And, uh, I guess up key is the one I wanted. Shift key is gonna speed me up. Well, we'll see why am I going. I got, it takes me some getting used to, to fly in space. I think arrow keys are your friend. No, 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 no. It's, it's like a combo of both. All right, back home on safe on my planet. So that's where we'll end episode 10 with my voice actually being recorded and a quick tutorial on making processors, which is like super basic. Uh, all you need is uh, circuit boards and microcrystalline chips. And yeah, so next episode, I think we're gonna head to the next planet and make us a silicone farm so we can start producing that all right everybody thanks for stopping by definitely give me a like or a comment with any suggestions on other stuff you'd like to see and i'll be back in episode 11. thanks a lot have a good one enjoy your galaxy and your cluster and we'll see you later <laughs>